Now I'd like to talk about abdominoplasty, also known as a tummy tuck. Now what a tummy tuck is, is uh, basically resection of your mid-abdomen skin and uh, soft tissue. And most of the time that happens, we do that for people who have excess skin hanging here and a lot of uh, fat underneath. It's not just made for people who want to lose a little bit of weight, you know, two, three pounds because they uh, want to do liposuction. This is actually they have skin problems and they have excessive skin which needs to be resected because just removing fat by liposuction is still going to leave redundant skin and it's not going to look good. So people, some, you know, people who have a redundant skin hanging, especially in your abdomen, are the classic candidates for uh, tummy tuck. Now this redundant skin, you have that, you know, many people have it, one, because of pregnancy second because of aging, third because of being overweight, and fourth because you were overweight or obese and now you've lost a lot of weight. So all those reasons uh, people you know, are the type of people who come to my office to have uh, a tummy tuck done. So for the first thing I do obviously we'll have a consult in my office, I'll go over the entire procedure and exactly describe step-by-step -step detail how we're going to do it. The procedure is done in a hospital, it is done under general anesthesia for your comfort. Uh, and once we start, once you, you know, we get all the preoperative testing done and so on, you finally the day will come, you go to the OR, under general anesthesia, after you're all prepped and draped, we'll start the surgery. And the first part of the surgery is basically we'll make an incision from side to side right under your skin. So, it, so basically when you keep the incision really low, so you can uh, hide it under your uh, bikini or underwear. Next you come up and you resect the entire uh, piece of uh, fat and, and skin that you have, the excessive skin that's hanging. You take it out, you remove it, you send it out to, uh, you know, off the table. And then underneath you have these muscles, your abdominal muscles that, you know, some of us haven't seen in, in forever. We basically, over time, they stretch out. And what we do is we actually tighten them by imbricating or by putting uh, rows, like four rows of sutures, actually bringing them in. So not only are we removing the fat and skin, we're actually imbricating the muscle and making your entire waistline a lot smaller. It's kind of like taking this jacket and if you just fold it in, you're going to find that the more you fold it, the thinner it gets around the sides and the flatter it gets in the front. So we do the same exact thing of your abdominal wall muscles. So, you know, giving you this tiny little waist. And the last part of the tummy tuck is actually we take that skin, we bring it to the top part of the skin that we resected, we bring it down and we stitch it back on to the bottom part. So you basically have a scar that's way down here. The rest of the abdomen is completely flat and uh, we just stitch up the, the, the incision down below. We leave a couple of drains inside and we put an abdominal binder on. The binder stays on for the next 24 hours. After that, you could remove it, take a shower and so on. The couple of drains that are inside, they stay for, a, one of them usually comes out in a week and the second one usually about two to three weeks. There is an overnight stay in the hospital and that's required because people usually are comfortable with some uh, IV medication and some you know, nurses taking care of them. Generally, that's true for heavier patients. Some of the smaller patients who are not as heavy, they can go home the same day. And it's, you know, we do that all the time. Uh, now I'd like to show you some photographs of the before and after of what a tummy tuck looks like. So if you go to my website here on the metaobesitycenter.com and you hit down there, you scroll down below and you hit the, the logo for, uh, for tummy tuck, I think the logo says body contouring, that'll bring you to this page. And on this page you'll see one of my patients who we did an abdominoplasty on or the tummy tuck. Now this lady had a laser lipos, I'm sorry, she had a uh, bariatric surgery done where she lost a tremendous amount of weight, over 100 pounds or so, and she had this excessive skin hanging there. What we wanted to do was, of course, remove all that skin and give her a nice flat abdomen. As you can see where the markers are up here, uh, the, the line that I made there with using a marker is showing where the skin incision is made, and the bottom skin incision is really very low, just above your, your uh, thighs. All that extra part of the fat and skin is removed. The top incision is then pulled down and stitched together and you can see right next to it, the uh, after picture, the uh, incision is completely hidden in a regular bathing, bathing suit or underwear. And if you scroll down below a little bit, you'll see that same patient down here with the side profile. So that's her before and after, uh, you know, very happy lady. If you keep scrolling down, that's just the same person, uh, just uh, the right side view. Again, this is again one day, you know, the procedure itself takes about three hours and it's a one day overnight procedure. Um, that's pretty much it as far as abdominoplasty goes. And if you have any questions, you know, look around on my website and certainly uh, call us. We'll be happy to talk to you.